Hey, baby. No, I don't want Ellie. I don't, I don't want that hard to fix right now. What was that? Uh, probably just this thing. The setup. Yeah, 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 I know. Sure. Crystal, baby. world contacts have all the morphine? No, they don't. We doled it out, hoping we could control it. 
Are they pressing you for further allocation? That's the polite way of putting it, Doctor. I may be able to help you, Courtney. Thanks, Doctor. It helps just to talk about it. I mean, I have a solution that will help you financially and salve your conscience. I'm all ears, Doctor. I will transact to take all the narcotic off your hands. You can rest assured that it will all be medically administered. I will use the funds that I no longer require for the purchase of medication and invest them in housing developments. Housing? The developments in question are housing projects for former servicemen. Your return will come from the sale of the properties, and your investment will benefit those that you care for most. Does this arrangement meet with your approval? You're a magician, Doctor. I still don't like the Doctor and this guy. So I gotta find the... There's a phone number we can run by R&I. Plus a bunch of names and odds. You're not the only one who likes to flutter, Roy. Okay, that's it. I gotta go use the telephone. Where's the telephone? You better find that cocksucker and you bring him to me. I feel bad too, Mickey. He guaranteed me he would take the flop. I guarantee that you will be fish food if you don't bring me. Roy, you out of pocket too? Mickey, seems that way. Oh, oh who's that, Bobby? Don't Krista? Boys are out looking for him. Who's that, Bobby? This is a police matter now. If anything happens to Hammond, I'll testify that you made threats against him. Who's the Greyhound? He's a frisky one, isn't he? Cole Phelps? Mickey Cohen. I know who he is, Roy. I, uh, met his brother-in-law. <gasps> it's Bobby Crystal? I think you had the mixture pretty scared back there. Operator, give me R and I. Putting you through now. Crystal, let me tell you. Cole Phelps, badge 1247. No. How can I help you? I need an address for the following phone number AL345. The address for the phone number is the Hotel El Mar, 6294 Leland Way, Hollywood. Thank you. What? You know the place? Huh. Flop house. Everyone's Every, right? no just trying to be safe, fast. you know. Yes, everyone's still trying to be safe. You're behind the wheel. Hey, baby. Somebody's seem been sleeping this whole time you've been away. Hey. Do I know the hint of reprimand in your it's tone, okay, baby. detective? Yeah. Talking to gangsters comes with the turf. You should try out Mickey's place. He's got a haberdasher's up on Sunset. See if he can get you out of those old man's clothes that you slink around in. It's a front for his illegal activities. It is that, What's that oh? but he does yeah, carry some very gone? sharp suits. If it's okay with you, I'll stick with Brooks Brothers. Oh, <gasps> Crystal! She's cleaning herself, so she can. She can. You have to definitely get her attention. 
<laughs> She's like, ooh, mommy got me more food. Mommy got you more food, baby. I LAPD. We're making inquiries into the whereabouts of an Albert Hammond. No one here by that name. You sure? Sure, I'm sure. This isn't the sort of place where people use their real names. Take a look at the register if you don't believe me. She wants a five star. Goddamn. Okay, so look for prominent Tommies. That should narrow it down. Oof, Marilyn Monroe was here. Winston Churchill. But look, just also Very Marilyn Monroe's been in this thing in room two oh seven. The old bulldog. Even at a flop house, Adley can't get out from the shadow. product of choice. Seems like a lifetime ago. Candy has expensive taste. Albert has his work cut out for it. Who's Candy? Candy Edwards, the lady who filled out this coupon. The fighter has plenty of time on his hands between bouts. Oh. Does Albert have somebody special? I didn't see anyone in his corner at the fight. Alright, let's go after his girl. See if that gets us any closer. He must be heading home. You know, I hope he makes it. That crooked son of a bitch, no chance. It's still warm. Shadow, what are you doing? You're attacking your tail. Looks like Albert's been doing some homework. Eleven grand would be a nice little nest egg. Oh, 
Okay, finally, I got all this stuff. if you want. All I do is keep my head down and replace the towels. You can drive. You drive, buddy. I don't want to drive. So I'm at the house, too. Marines. We all did. Standard training. I can't imagine you ever played dirty. The only prize for taking a fall was a thousand push-ups. Hi, Crystal. What? Shadow! Okay. Yeah, I can see. I can hear that. Shadow the weirdo. We need to know which what? room is Candace. Shadow. I'm out of here. LAPD, ma'am. We're looking for Candy Edwards. Shadow. Apartment seven. <laughs> Not sit down. Not sit still. Turn left at the top. Shadow. You Take friends of the Italian guy. Italian guy? Yeah. Sleazy type. Gave his name as Carlo. I didn't like the look of it, but Candy has some funny friends. Thanks. This candy broad must be as sweet as she says. All these down, gentlemen dummy. call us. I'm gonna take that blanket off so you don't have anything to be to sit on up there. Mm -hmm. Not in your life, Buster. Jump down, Shadow. Yes, go. Well, you don't see that every day. Yeah, I hit him too. Yes, yes, I was. I'm out of here. Chris was like, what the fuck is going on with Shadow? <laughs>
This is where I'm supposed to go. Get in there. Help. Help. Where are we oh. Like hitting women, do you? We are not going to end well, well friends. Oh. All right. You really want to dance? There it is, baby. Oh, no. You had to get up. What is wrong with you? You've got the energy right now, don't you? Yep. She knows. Out cold, but breathing. Give her a minute. Take a look around. Carlo here seems to have the same friends as Hammond. What are the odds on them all being bookmakers? Edwards? Sure, I've had worse. I'll shake it off. We're trying to track down Albert Hammond. We have reason to believe he might be in danger. Do you know where he is? No, I don't. I'm over Albert. I haven't seen him. You're lying, Candy. You were in his hotel room. He came back after the fight and you weren't there. What happened? You can't prove that I was in the room. How do you think we found you, Candy? You wrote your name and address on a coupon. Look, Albert was supposed to take a fall. We were all supposed to make a little money out of it. But Albert got too goddamn stubborn. Said his pride was all he had left. So I told him, shove it. Let's see his pride keep him warm tonight. So you walked out before the fight? Yes, I did. What's the problem? I didn't take anything. Do the names Harry, Mervyn, or Ray mean anything to you? Could be anybody. How the hell would I know? They're bookmakers, aren't they? Tell me the truth. How the hell would I know? Albert wrote his winnings down on a notepad in the hotel room. We found the odds in his lock. Who has the betting slips? That son of a bitch, Albert. Everyone thought he was dumb, including me. Beat them all. You're leaving town, Miss Edwards? Yes, I'm going straight home. Albert is going home by boat as soon as he collects his winnings. I know you're going to meet him. Albert is going to collect nothing. He'll be lucky if he can get out of town in one piece. How will you fare any better? They already believe you're in on it. Hell, I know you're in on it. You can think what you want, but hey, I'll take my chances. You keep an eye on mommy? To run and then I say adios to this dumbass. 
Do you want to press charges against our Carol? Just get him out of here. That's all I want. Get out, Carlo, you hump. And get rid of that pig sticker. You ever pull that thing on me, I'll shoot you like a dog. That bitch knows where Hammond is. She knows where my money's gone. My money, too, tough guy. I'll handle this. Good luck, my sir. I hope things work out for you. Thank you. Very kind of you to say so. Bad people are looking to hurt Candy, and yet she's not heading straight for the train station. I smell a payoff. I say stake her out. See where she goes. Tail is broad. Don't let her get away, but don't get spotted. I'll bring up the car behind you. Uh, don't mind me, it's been in this paper. notice me. Nope, nothing here, lady. Nothing here. Keep walking. Yes, you keep walking. I'm just here. I'm just walking here like you are. up a little bit. Long Canito, Brissa. Bennett, at risk of losing the trail. Oh, okay, she's moving. I just didn't know, I did not want her to spot me. Too much slack. Eventually he'll come back. It's not right now. He just visited. And eventually you'll, you'll get Savannah and you'll get Celeste. Well, that uh, part that was watched well, on the beach, will he come back? Yeah, he'll come back every once in a while. You have to find the communication parts every time for him. Because he'll give you um, places, little things to for other from other places. I forget what he gave me. Uh, I have to check. I haven't, I haven't seen Too him in a while. Gotta get closer. I got a few things that that day, so I have to remember what it was. We've been at risk losing the trail. Too much slack. Gotta get closer. Oh, if you got the solstice crown, that's from me. What the, what the, the, the Yeah, I sent that to you. Because it's in your thing. 
bend it. I risk losing the trail. Slack. Is there anything to bring your angle closer? I don't know. I'll open it up after the stream. I'm still here. Alright. Okay. 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 I'm just gonna trail this lady until. Just came in here. She went out the back way. Said she was being watched. How much did she collect? Thirty-six hundred dollars. She claimed me out on the Hammond Kid Galahad fight. You got it. I'm not complaining. We all made a lot of money on that one. Huge plunge on Galahad, and then Hammond knocks the bum out. So she collected the money and went out through the back door. Nope. She made a phone call over there, wrote something on a notepad, and then left. What are you doing? An old intelligence trick from the Marines. Can you drive to this one? Yeah, you drive, buddy. Hammond I only drive when I have to chase somebody. And Candy is picking up the winnings. Smart play. Yeah. The question is, is Candy collecting on Albert's behalf, or is she cheating him too? Car 11 K 11 King, further to your request, Bumco Fraud has three known bookmakers operating out of storefronts in the Hollywood area. Thrifty Liquor, 6106 Santa Monica, the Examiner Drugstore, and a Max Spirits at 16. Detectives Phelps and Earl, LAPD. Relax, Cole. You just have a blonde in here, Mervyn? Sure did. I'm just about to close up. She took me to the cleanest. 4,000 clams and change. How long ago did she leave? Maybe five minutes. 
called again. Asked for a number. I told her there was a guard over there by the phone. Yellow cap. We need to get after her fast. Operator, give me dispatch. Putting you through now. Can you connect me to the Yellow Cab Company? Hollywood 2187, please. This is Detective Phelps, LAPD. You dispatched a cab to 1487 Ivar Avenue, Hollywood. Yes, sir. Send one round to the pool. Do you have the number of that cab? Thanks. We're done playing around. Get Mervyn to give us an address on Ray's place. You have any idea who Ray is? Sugar Ray. Not now, Mervyn. Cole doesn't have much of a sense of humor at the best of times. Ray runs a shop up on North Cherokee Avenue. Just sell the Hollywood Boulevard. You drive. I need to go over the case notes. This broad's planning on cleaning out every bookmaker in town. Hammond needed to make sure he was getting a bigger payday than if he'd taken the flop. Never trust the limeys, especially where a fight's concerned. A mistake we can't seem to stop making. My partner was the one driving now. I... Don't lose that cab. Hammond is over the hill. He's a punching bag for the up-and-comers. She knows goddamn place. I think he knows. I think he worked out the place no. isn't LA. I just gotta tell He's them. Punchy. His brain's going Don't to mush. You Winston dare Churchill. Hit me. I'm trying to stay Camito. Churchill is a fighter, Roy. Hammond didn't just scribble down the first name he could think of. I just have to trail them, so I can't lose Can you quit driving like a jackass already? Oh, 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 I have to trail them, and I have to stay at least a car distance away from them. Oh, yeah, it just hit me. Hammond is full of himself, being this sure he was gonna win. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, of course, you run right into me before I could turn. Oh, okay, you're turning that way. You got a pretty funny idea of what keeping a low profile means, Phelps. That bitch is giving me what I'm owed. That's all I know. It's called I'm trying my best here, buddy. Out, buddy, you hit me. Pull over. He's heading inside.
just saw Hammond. I'll tail him. You get in there and stay with Candy. Make sure you don't let her see you. She tears the orange juice for hours. Well, it does say concentrated in cartons. Is somebody gonna tell us what the hell is going on? That's the guy from the papers. Saw that big case. See him? Dead. Oh no, she's not dead yet. Call an ambulance. <laughs> Haven't got away. <laughs> he said it. Just so try and sit still, Candy. Who shot you? Was it Albert? <laughs> They're on the way. I have a patrolman searching the depot. The chief's putting together a manhunt for Hammond. He got the money, right? Looks like it. A tough bird, our limey friend. Using his girlfriend as the bag woman and then getting greedy over the split. He won't make it out of town. That's how you see it? I told you that cocksucker was a crook. Caliber, one shot fired. The Egyptian Theater. This is gonna lead to a shootout. So what now? The theater, I guess. We don't have much else to go on. You know the way. You can drive. Yeah, you drive me, buddy. Mm. Poor girl. She didn't deserve that. Poor girl. Half the precinct aren't taking a vacation this year because of her. You need to leave town a lot quicker than that if you decide to screw over Mickey C. Too? Come on, Roy. We're bringing this whole tragedy to its conclusion. Why'd you kill her, Carla? You go out with me. She was collecting the money for you. Mickey made it clear it was either me or you, and, and I intend to keep on living. She stole them things, She was running out on me. Then you were gonna let her? No, I let her collect. I set her up. 
just like she set me up. Just like my manager set me up. Everyone wanted me to take a dive. Everyone wanted me to take a short money. It's for the best thing. You were washed up, kid. You couldn't climb and you were too brave to sink. You were going nowhere. Maybe, but I had heart. I was a Royal Marine, Carlo. If I lost a fight, it wasn't for lack of trying. And it wasn't for lack of courage. I didn't have much. But I had that. I did it for you, and that's how you repay me! You did it for yourself. So did little boy. You did it and made a quick buck. Candy did it and made a dream come true. Blah, blah, blah. I've got the money. All I need to do is get rid of you. It's going to be a shame, kid, but that's business. Mistake, Arcaro. Reinforcements are on the way. Cease and desist. There you are, you're up there. I'm wide open here. I need to go up there. Clearly some space here. Where are you? The what? You yeah, you can they'll go back. Too. I just don't remember the rock I have right now. I have lots of weeds. He's covering a lot of
Put the gun down, Roy. That son of a bitch owes me a lot of money. Catch. Escania sails from New York, Em. Be on the next train. Don't ever come back. Why? Because I was a Marine, and I once lacked courage. Everyone deserves a second chance. Now beat it. What, Shadow? What are you looking at me for? You're just sitting there looking at me. Fuck you! That English prick is getting She's away like with this, my like money, Phelps. Look. Hey, baby. Donnelly and the Homicide Squad send their best, Phelps. They're more than pleased that you wrapped up the Edwards killing. They're a little mystified about the motive. You have any ideas on that? Uh, crime of passion, sir. Uh, looks like some sort of love triangle between the manager, the fighter, and uh, uh, his girlfriend. No sign of the scrapper? No, sir. Looks like he left town after the fight. Okay. It's homicide's problem now. Good work, gentlemen. Oh. I was hiccuping. <sighs> Someone's a little bit sleepy. 187 at 5810 Murata Avenue. Homicide wants you over there. The coroner thinks the broad was whacked using the army morphine. Don't say anything, Roy. Just get over there. That get up of yours, anyway. I should start introducing it as Detective Earl, this is my science teacher, Mr. Phelps. Your interest in my appearance is starting to get me worried. Like it or not, we're a dysfunctional couple now. People judge me with you on my arm the same way they would a fat broad with a five o'clock shadow. <laughs> I really hope you're joking, Roy. Sorry, buddy. Can you drive to this one? Seem distracted. I always make them drive unless the I have theme. to drive. Some of it might be unaccounted for. I can actually hear this little That's dialogue. Life. We did our job. If not, they'll be saying, go this way, go that way, go this way, go that way. Another. Yeah, Do I don't want to hear that all the time. Do you have really going on while we're wasting our time following this stuff? Are you going to tell me? The deals being done right now will change the face of L.A. forever, and we're wasting our time on some hump. Someone's little girl. Visit the morgue at the end of the month when the John and Jane Doe's are cremated. Their percentages. The odds for and against lightning striking. I gotta play with my other characters first so I can give them their the DIYs and see if there's any extras I can give you. to check, I can't remember. Bukowski, you made homicide. That I did. Good to see you, Phelps. You two want a hug? Or can we get on? Relax, Rusty. Hey, Rusty. 26 years old, fashionable. Found in the tub by a cleaning lady, Mrs. Reynolds. She called it in. 
We heard Carruthers thing. Carruthers yeah, you can just look, or, just look around. There's always Overdose some hiding sleep. somewhere. Falls asleep in the tub. Rest in peace. Case closed. Here, here. Mal is 100% that it's murder. Do you mind if I take a look around? Sure. Go right ahead. <laughs> There's like little indents where you can, it can, you know. No, Val, we've had a look around. Rusty thinks it's a waste of time. What's your theory? Come on, Mal. Tell us why we were dragged down here. If the victim was alive when she entered the tub, water would have entered her lungs. The water is violently churned in the windpipe as she drowns. The result is that a lot of foam is generated. This foam is found at the mouth and nostrils in almost all I'm just glad she's closed. Around. Notice anything yeah. about our pick? Yeah. Yeah, I took a look. Be my guess. Take a closer look at her head and neck. The neck is bruised pretty badly. Bruising on the forearms and these look like bite marks. Very good. Very unusual ring. It could be wrong, but it looks like a black sapphire. The eyes are a classic sign of morphine. The bruises tell their own story. I think one man held her down, and another held her arm and injected her. They put her in the bath to try to cover it as a drowning. It's got a trail of barbiturates. Take a look around outside on your way out and see if you can find the serrettes. It would make my theory. The morphine would have been very quick, and there wouldn't have been much of a struggle. Okay, so find two guys who recently bought serrettes and weren't junkies. You might be onto something. I guess I had to examine those pills. Pretty girl like that? Maybe she was having trouble with some boys, huh? She got her heart broken. This is all top end of town stuff. Gives us somewhere to look. So she ran herself a bath and down some pills, and then she just drifted off. I don't know. Truly, she always had so much fire. Nothing that one. They're there. There's been a modeling assignment. It's okay. It's place to start. Beautiful girl. Clothes certainly aren't from the Sears catalog.
barbiturates. Pleased. Well, that's hardly conclusive, given the number of those things we've come across recently. The autopsy will confirm it one way or another. Oh, oh. thank you. Hello. Okay, so I'm gonna go talk to the maid now. I think that's Virginia. Oh wait, let me check the time. Yeah, I'm just checking the time on my thing here. 